So, uh, we've already had the cheese man, so why not just have a, a ham man? Hello my fellow gangsters, uh, this is Joseph Brostar here uh, to bring you uh, my thoughts on, on episode 14 of Bento Aureo. Uh, they found a, a, a key with a clue all on it and they told them to bring them to the, to the train station in Napoli uh, to take them to Venice because apparently that is where uh, the boss is. So in this episode instead of one enemy we had two enemies. We had, our, had the thick neck boy Pesci or no neck boy simply and prosciutto. So pesci and prosciutto, it means fish and ham in Italian. Had an introduction to the turtle uh, stand. So what it does is creates a room inside it and somehow it has electricity. Mm. Oh yes, and TV signal because in the manga they they were watching Captain Tsubasa. Huh. Wonder what? Wonder if that's why they gave it. Production decided to take on the Captain Tsubasa. Well, but anyway, so we don't have a new OP because apparently uh, the studio ran out of money. Uh, to uh, to make uh, another OP, which I guess it's understandable. I mean, Mega King and anime anime is really hard and costs a lot of money. So, but we have we don't have a new ending, so it's still freaking you with uh, freaking you. By Jodeci, but but there's a new show to be ending, and I think that one is so much better, cause because at the beginning I had a problem with the ending, and it wasn't the song in particular; it was just the visuals. I thought the visuals the visuals were weak, so. This one, uh, they are actually pretty captivating. Uh, I think it's uh, pretty, so it does a better job at getting my attention. Uh, yeah, so the visuals for this new ending are very captivating, and I think it's so pretty. I think it looks looks pretty, looks pretty calming with the plant that is growing. I got it safely inside of the turtle. The uh, the enemy still knows that the uh, and the gang are still uh, are still there. So that's a big problem when when Ham brings of this stand that makes people age, so he's gonna. Uh, so he plans to age everyone inside uh, the train in order to kill the gang. And it's very complicated how how it works, but targets you based on your body temperature, much like your heart attack. Uh, so, uh, so just look over here. It, what happens to the gang is, is that is that Giorno, Fugo, uh, Baggio, and, and Narancia are both basically 
turned into my grandpa. Uh, so that's not that good. But but apparently, Trisha and, and the Bucarati and Mista they are they are okay. But that is because they had cool drinks and the turtles somehow the turtles somehow has electricity in him there oh no there must be tiny uh, tiny generator running uh, uh, running uh, with a tiny fuel uh, yeah so they had cool drinks and their body temperature is cooler uh, why didn't why didn't Gucci think think about that when he was when he was being attacked by sheer heart attack? Well, uh, but that's how mafia works, I guess. So there, there we go. Yeah. So. So that's how they're gonna deal with them. But Mista was about to turn on the was about to turn on the the AC when he got attacked by Pesci's stand, which is called a Beach Boy, which which I think it's an appropriate stand and stand name to have since he's basically named. Uh, fish. Araki gave everyone in Vento Mario such ridiculous names that I can't even don't know what he thinks. So I would really love to interview him and what about it, the ridiculous names. In, in in the part five and how and how and how he decided to name everyone after food because it's it's interesting. So yeah, that is how we end our episode with Mister up about to about to attack our boys, but accidentally trade but accidentally. Triggering the stand, a uh, beach boy. While while Ham has has his other stand, whose name I forgot, just running wild in the train. So, uh, what did I think about? Uh, it's a. Uh, it's certainly a it's certainly a good episode. No, uh, stand battles so far. It's just people just just hanging around inside the turtle because that's how mafia works. And and the enemy stands attacking and when the good guys have to figure out what the bad guys what the bad guys stand this and what it does and Giorno uh, thought uh, he always always has has his uh, wits around about him yeah don't have much to say about my thoughts on the episode meaning that this video is bonus so but yeah the episode is uh, good I didn't find a bad episode in this anime that I didn't, I didn't like yet. Uh, so that's great. We are starting uh, 2019. Uh, great. I uh, don't know if I'm gonna watch the, the, the anime that recently got a controversy. I think I, I think I will and I'll Co cover it. I also have to watch the first episode of Mob Psycho 100 II. Uh, but 
And yeah, so what did you guys think about this this episode? Uh, and do you wanna just kill me? I mean, those are all pre pretty great uh, questions. But uh, anyway, so my fellow gangsters, I'll see you actually have something big planned. So later this week.